Welcome to Machines and More. Welcome to CES 2026 at Asus's booth here. I'm here to take a look at a brand new GPU. It is in their Pro Art series. Not exactly the same design as the 5080, 5070 Ti that you might have seen. Um, it has to have a dual flow through design. Let's take a look here. All right, so up to this point, the Pro Art cards topped out at the 5080, their newest announcement, which is the top end 5090, features a very different cooler design compared to their 5070 Ti and 5080 Pro Arts. Now you notice two large 115 millimeter fans instead of the three smaller ones on the uh, other Pro Art cards. This should have a better noise profile. And this one features a dual flow through section. Most of the side of the GPU is closed off in order to force the exhaust out of the backplate side of the card. So the end flow through section is a little bit open on the side. Now this one is compliant with the NVIDIA SFF ready dimension at 2.5 slots. Although uh, ASUS did not have the exact specs on hand when I filmed this from my estimate, it does appear to be roughly 300 millimeters long and 130 millimeters tall. Now, speaking of SFF in sandwich style cases without enough space or ventilation between the backplate and the spine of the case, this may not work as well. Ideally, you will be using this somewhere where there is at least some room for airflow. So you may need to space the cart out away from the spine. Uh, the 12 volt connector location is different. It is vertically oriented while still being recessed. Uh, still features the black and gold aesthetic with dark wood trim. And on the IO side, it does trade off a DP port for a USB-C one. That's something they've done with the ProArt graphics cards. And along with this card is a refresh for what ASUS is tagging with this NEO moniker. This one is the ProArt B850 Creator NEO. If you want to go for that themed build, these two will jive nicely together. A really nice looking GPU. I think this is one of the best 5090 designs that I've seen. And it is two and a half slots. So that is uh, promising for those of you that can't get the Founders Edition card. And uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to this. From what I hear, the ETA is somewhere around Q2 uh, 2026, a little bit TBA uh, in the air. So uh, we'll give you all the updates when that comes. So make sure you are subscribed, make sure you give a like here and big thanks for watching.